Yo, what is going on, YouTube? It is your boy, Double A Nine Skills, and you're probably like, wait, what the hell is going on? No one really saw this coming. This is a curveball out of nowhere. So I was uh, reading the comments down below, and I have seen this suggested a few times. Years ago, maybe two years ago, one of my most popular career modes on YouTube, actually my most popular career modes on YouTube, is the Dortmund career mode and a Befica career mode. Now, the Befica career mode is way too easy to do. Liga Nos is too easy of a league to compete in. So I always do something special when I do Befica. Now, I was reading the comments down below of teams you guys wanted me to mess with. And I was also hanging out in my girl's stream in the chat. Started, we were talking about career mode. And someone requested that why not do what we did a few years back. So what I've done is I have created the super the, the european super league now for this to continue i would need you guys to get this to at least six thousand likes it's got to be at least six thousand likes i have taken the epl the premier league and i have put a lot i don't want to say all of them i want to say a lot of the best european teams a lot of the powerhouses into one league people have been saying skills can you take a mid-table team can you take a lower team well and don't get more mid-table than this. We are taking Befica and we are competing against Spurs, Roma, Real Madrid, PSG, Napoli, uh, Milan, Manchester United, Manchester City, Liverpool, Juventus, Inter Milan, Barcelona, Dortmund, Chelsea, Celtic, Bayern, Atletico Madrid, Arsenal, and Monaco. Now, again, there is a few teams 100% left out. But I try to grab a lot of the best teams from in Europe to create the Super League and to create one of the hardest leagues. And yes, I am still going to mess around with sliders. In this episode, I'm not going to go too far. I'm not going to dig in too deep because, bros, I need you guys to tell me that, yes, this is a great idea. I need you to do this. I want to see more of this. So smash a big old thumbs up. And if you want to watch more career modes, make sure to subscribe right here on the More A9 Skills channel. If you're coming from my main channel, see, this is my second channel. So make sure to subscribe. This is where the career mode goes down. And with that being said, bros, transfer windows open. I don't really read this board expectations. I don't really care, bro. I know what my expectations are. My expectations are to win the league. If we can't win the league, it's an absolute failure. Um, so with that being said, bros, oh, man, um, the moves I would make with Befica. Look, you don't think it's a challenge? I got 86 million. 86 million. As you can see, our top sole players is Ederson, Nelson, Smith, the Barcelona, Lendenloff. Uh, that's it. Oh, man, I, we got a terrible keeper. Um, anyways, look, we got 86 million, all right? Wait, 86 million? We got 26, 20 million. 20 million to waste, and our team looks like like this. Jonas up top. Uh, we brought this striker in. He plays for, I believe he's from Switzerland. He's playing in the World Cup right now. He's probably not going to play for us. We got PZ, Servi, Salvio, Faisha, Luizong, Jardel, LSAU, and Andre Almeida. At the left back position, we do have a great left back. Obviously, you guys know who it is. We're going to go ahead and throw the Spanish man in at left back. But, bros, this is a challenge in itself. Rafa Cup brings a bunch of speed. But, bros, this team right here has to win the EPL against a bunch of crazy, crazy talented players. Um, I mean, a bunch of crazy talented teams. Now, I believe this update, like, it's not updated. So, Carilu's still on the team. Andre Arthur's still on the team. A lot of these players, it's not the newest updated because when you create, you can't update all the way, I don't think. I think it has to be this way, unfortunately. So, I believe that Felipe Coutinho will actually still be on Liverpool. Let me find out. So, because it's a, um, a, 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 a edited career mode because it's an updated league i believe you can't update the squad because i tried and it didn't let me um so with that being said i believe let me find liverpool i'm pretty sure liverpool would still have felipe coutinho let's find out Sturridge is there um to see if you guys see something origi is origi actually there or is he on loan i think he's on loan salamane yeah see felipe coutinho is still on liverpool at this time in the career mode. So it's not the updated one, uh, but it's pretty close. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, bros, the first move I would make as the manager of Befica in a very, 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 very tough league that we are about to compete in is what I would do is actually, before I even sim any forward, Rashford always gets stolen every single career mode I ever do. So I'm going to try to sneak in there, and I don't got the money for Rashford. There's no point of me even trying to buy. If we want to compete in this league, if we actually want to beast and feast in this league, the only possible way for us to beast and feast and get it right, get it tight, is actually to try to, oh man, the club is not interested in loaning. 
Ah, that just feels bad, bro. I, yo, I really, really, really wanted Rashford. I legitimately really just wanted Rashford, bros. But um, I don't really have players I could swap. I guess I'm going to try to step in there. And um, I still have Mitroglu. We actually sold him in real life. Mitroglu does not play for Benfica. We sold him. He is gone. Um, so I'm going to try to actually sell him as well in this career mode. And see if I can get... They want a right back. Um, offer a player... All I got is Andre Almeida. I legitimately need right backs. They want 31 million. I mean, I just don't got that. I I, I just don't got that, man. I, I legit just I just don't. That's just not something that's in the cards for me, bro. I got 20. I just don't got that money, bro. So um, we're gonna have to reject that. But I'm telling you guys right now, this is going to be the if we do it, this is going to be the biggest and the hardest challenge I have ever dealt with in any career mode because. We have to compete with this team. And how is it even like, look at it, yo. Like, what the hell are we going to do, man? Let me go ahead and put players for sale right now. For example, I'm going to try to sell Julius Cesar as he actually left in real life as well for free. So I'm going to try to sell him. Um, Let me see. Let me go down. Lisandro Lopez went on loan, but I'm not. I'm going to keep him around. Faiza's a beast. A, a Samurai, I'm going to sell him. Samurai is, is probably going to go. Um, Garilu, I like him. We let him go to Watford on loan in the game, but he's still a part of the squad. I think I'm going to keep him around. Cristant is an absolute beast, but for some reason, Befica just don't like him in real life, and they ended up selling him. BZ, Andre Arta went in on loan in real life, so I'm going to go ahead and sell him. Um, as I continue to go down, we can go ahead and he just got here, so we can't get rid of him. Um... Damn, bros, how the hell are we going to compete? We got Tarat, but he's only a 70 overall. Rafa's there. A uh, beast that came in from Stubble, I believe he came. I like this guy a lot, man. This guy's an absolute beast. Talishka's on loan. I'm about to recall that, man. How much to recall Talishka? Yo, I'm going to have to recall Talishka, bro. That's, 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 uh, that's for sure. I'm recalling him. I don't care. I'm recalling Talishka from, from Busquets. I have to, man. I need him here. We need him. I can sell him. I, I could use his money. I'd rather sell him than have him out on loan if we're not going to use him. We just brought this striker in, so I can't sell him. Mitroglu, I can sell, which I'm willing to sell. Jonas, our top goal scorer, I'm not selling him. Raul Jimenez went on loan in real life. So since he went on loan on real life, I'm going to go ahead and add him on the transfer list. Doesn't mean he's leaving. And that's kind of where we're at, bros. That's that's where we stand as of right now. That's the squad we have. I brought back Talishka, possibly to sell him. But bros, I'm telling you right now, man, this is going to be by far the biggest challenge. I need center backs. I need a right back. I need a striker. I need everything pretty much. I don't even know where to begin, but bros, in the comments down below, can you guys blow it up and can you guys help me buy players that are cheap? I'm not going to be able to sign great players. We're going to have to sign players like this. 23-year-old Servi from Argentina. Um, we're going to have to sign players like, I actually might let go of Salvio. I legit might let go of Salvio. I know y'all probably think I'm crazy, but I think his time has come and gone for Benfica in real life and in this career mode. He goes for, you know, we probably can get some solid money for him. So I actually think I'm going to go ahead and let go of, I never get to do Benfica career modes. Um, so it would be very interesting to see what I do with this team. Benfica won four leagues in a row. Um, they were going for their fifth and they couldn't do it. So uh, we got to fix them. Salvio, it's time for him to go, man. He's getting up there. Now he's only 26, but I think it's time for him to go. We still have Carilu here. What can we do, man? What I know we're going to have to use a lot of youth. I actually want to talk to Manchester United about one more thing, and I'll do that in just a minute. Let's see what's up with the free agents. On the free agent list, we got, is he any good? A right back? Is he any good? A free agent right back? I wonder if he's any good, because if he's any good, like any good at all, we could absolutely use him. Yo, that's 100% facts. We need a goalkeeper as well. A goalkeeper is a must. As I continue to look down this list, I'm not really seeing anybody yet that stood out. That right back might be solid. Um, let's continue, baby. Is there anybody here that can improve this squad? It ain't hard to improve it, man. FIFA makes the Befica squad really suck. I'm looking hard, bros. I'm looking hard, bros. Is there any way we can improve the squad through free agency? I don't see anybody. Again, man, I don't know if this career mode is going to go on. I really hope it does, man. Smash that big old thumbs up. It could be fun. It could be nasty. It could be legit. Um, yo, I don't see nothing, broskies.
I legit, I legit don't see nothing. I wonder if that right back is any good. Probably not, but... Um, all right, let's go to Manchester United real quick. The reason I came over to, 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 to Manchester United is because they, they have a ton of center backs. They got Eric Bailly, they got Phil Jones, they got Lendon Loft, they got Rojo, they got Chris Smalling. Um, they have a lot of center backs, so I want to see if they'll loan any of them. Lendon Loft, he just moved there, so I don't think we'll be able to get him back. Eric Bailly, Phil Jones, I'm going to see if they'll loan me any of them, bro. At this point, I will take any of them, straight up, any of them, I will take on loan. I know they have a ton of good young center backs, so I'm going to try my best to finesse a loan deal here. Let's see what we could do, man. All right, they're not looking to loan him out. And they're also not looking to loan him out. So Chris Smalling and Eric Bailly are a no-go. But they're still Rojo and Lindelof. So I know you guys might think I'm crazy. But I pretty much put the entire Manchester United uh, team roster on, on my shortlist. See, so Eric Bailly and Smalling won't come. Lindelof obviously just moved there. Let's see if we can get him on loan. The team is not looking to loan him out. Lengard, what are they saying, bro? Damn, the club isn't interested in loaning out this player. Wow, none of them want to go. This this Pereira guy, this Pereira guy, man. What, what are they saying to him? The club, what the hell? Yo, are you, are you, are you? The club has recently inquired the player, so are not looking to, come on, man. What about Fellaini? Oh, my God. I'm going to be 100% honest with you guys, bro. This career mode is going to be beyond difficult. I don't even know. Like, it's so hard to sign players already with the big team that I don't even know how I would even sign players. This is going to be extremely difficult. If you want to see this extremely difficult career mode, smash a big old thumbs up. If you want me to just take over another team instead, let me know in the comments down below. You ain't got to dislike or anything. Just let me know in the comments down below. Be like, hey, Skills, how about just do this team or this team or that team? Um, and we can switch it up. But I really want to try to bring you guys something interesting, something more of a challenge, something that, you know, I could use my favorite team. You guys get to watch more of a challenge and see if you guys liked it, man. It was all an experimental, experimental video. If there's going to be an episode two or not, that's really up to you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope you guys think this series could be awesome. Also, Mbappe is at Monaco. So like I said, it's not the updated teams. Uh, what the hell's going why does they have the little thing over that why do they have the little sign it says oh because they're okay they're new um but yeah man let me know what you guys want i hope you guys enjoyed it big thumbs up and i will catch you guys maybe for benfica episode two tomorrow or a brand new caramel with a different team we'll see how it plays out i love your faces boy.